So one of my more popular videos is the one where I hired editors to edit my best race plays. But I think it's time to update that video with clips that aren't from the beta of Valorant. So I went on Fiverr and I searched for Valorant montages. And I saw a lot of really clean editors with a bunch of 5 star reviews. But I wanted to spice it up. So what I did was I hired two editors with 5 star reviews. So editors that have had a lot of clients and a lot of reviews. And then I scrolled all the way back 10 pages to find three editors that have had zero clients and zero reviews on Fiverr. Now that doesn't mean they're bad editors or anything. It just means that they haven't had any clients on Fiverr at least but I mean you gotta start somewhere and I decided to give some people a chance that haven't yet had their first review on Fiverr yet now usually when someone has zero reviews it's usually a red flag but I wasn't scared of losing any money or anything because I collaborated with Honey for this video Honey is sponsoring this video and if you don't know them already Honey is a free browser extension made for online shopping we all shop online these days so Honey is pretty useful for instance all of my PC components come from online shopping all right so first of all you can get Honey for free and it genuinely only takes two clicks then when you're checking out on one of your favorite shops Shopping sites, Honey pops up automatically and apply coupons to your desired item. If Honey finds a working coupon code, you just have to sit there and wait while the price on your item drops. I said it in earlier videos, I've had Honey on my PC for over a year now because I saw the extension in Mr. Beast video and, and so far they've helped me save prices on a bunch of stuff. Honey supports all kinds of stores from gaming to clothing to home decoration and even if you're hungry, even food delivery. I always try my sponsors before I actually promote them and as I said, I have had Honey even before they reached out to me. So take it from me, if you have a PC, Honey should definitely be on it. So join honey.com slash agent gumler right now and please use the link in my description so they know that I sent you. And thanks a lot again to Honey for sponsoring this video. Alright, so these are the clips that I sent the editors. So in this first clip, I wait to see if the enemy will follow the jet, but they don't. So I shoot jet and then I start spraying into the smoke to get an additional 3 kills. I then use my last sight to try and catch the last player off guard and then I kill him. So this is another clip that I've used a lot and I really like it because it was actually in the Riot Race montage as well. One enemy remaining. Raising slow, slow. <laughs> this clip is from one of my latest videos after the classic got nerfed. I got a collab for the classic right click, then one more kill and then I jumped to heaven. Because I'm feeling it and I'm just trying to get as much info and space on my team, because that's my job as a race. But I end up getting an ace, which is good. Oh, 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 oh. In this clip, I asked my Astro Duel to suck short. So I jumped in my ult to get a double and then I killed the suck guy. Oh my god. Oh my Jesus. I then pick up his orb and then I see where the jet shoots from. So I wall bang her and then I one, jump one, in one, with one, my judge, left. only to realize that the judge Ace. isn't really as accurate as I thought when you move. But I get rest and then I get the ace. So nice. Here's a really simple clip. I jump into A and split, and I get a no scope kill. So I was playing ranked, and I asked my Omen dude to flash B main if he hurt them. So he did, and I jumped in to try and capitalize the situation, and I got four kills and won us the match by that. So this clip is from one of my other videos where I met an Immortal player in a Discord Valorant group, and then I decided to do it with him. Alright, so let's see how the editors did. Our very first editor was KHXN, and he has been my absolute favorite editor to go to since the beginning of Valorant. I found him over a year ago when he had zero reviews, because I just wanted to use him for a video. And now he's killing it in the editing scene. His montage will cost you 10 euro if you decide to hire him. Yeah. 
Alright, so the reason I put KHX in first was to try and set the standard for what kind of montages I like personally. To me, this editor always makes such great fast-paced montages and I think his effects really complements the clips. It really does remind me of a Latif montage. Very well edited in my opinion. The only thing I don't really care for though is the text on the screen. But nevertheless, really clean montage that I hope can set a standard for the rest of the video. So the next editor was AC Joseph and he is our very first Zero Star editor. He had zero reviews on Fiverr and his montage costs 36 euro. So AC Joseph is clearly a really really talented editor, it all depends on which style you're into, but I think he definitely knows his editing stuff. I would say though that I'm more into fast paced montages like the first one we saw, where it's more about the clips than the edit itself, but nevertheless once again a great montage if you're into slower edits. The thing I actually really loved though, that I haven't seen before in the montage was the zoom in on the weapon and the effects when he did that, that was really clean. Alright so the third editor I hired was Suana15, and I gotta say he was very responsive as well so I get the 5 star reviews, his montage cost me 14 euro plus 3 extra euros in tag. Thanks. Hey Ross, sauce it up. Once again, clean edit, fast paced, just as I like it. I think it wasn't as good as the first edit, but genuinely was really nice to watch, and the knife animation sounds are just so nice to hear. So, really great montage. The only thing I didn't care so much for was the color customization. Our fourth editor is called XSYYY. And he's also someone on Fiverr that didn't have any reviews at all, not that I could find at least. And the montage cost me 6.77 euros. So a really short montage, but I think it was hella clean. Once again, I think the edit wasn't as much about the clips as the edit itself. But then again, if that's what you're into, then this was definitely a great edit. Also with really nice sound design. The only thing I found weird was the fact that the Phantom sounded like a vandal in the last clip. But still, really great montage. Our very last editor was also a Zero Star editor with zero reviews. I believe he was a Rainbow Six Siege editor as well. And his name is Noobly Man, and his montage cost me 6.81 euros. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Come on, my nigga, we on go, my nigga, for all them oh, hey, oh, Go! And I guess it was a mess. The picture I paint is never gonna change. I'll be sure we gone away. Come on, my nigga, we on go, my nigga, for all of my doors in the pen. You said you was gang, but you never hanging. I guess it was a man. The picture I paint is never gonna change. RPG, we gonna win. Spending this cash around to the back, we can do the shit all again. They all in the front, they show me love. Them bitches, they bought their friends. Got racks in my pants and ten in my hands. Look how long I wait for this. I'm Mary Jeans with Dolce Gabbana. Funny T on my door in the Prada. I stay flying, I do what I wanna. Who the prince of Flatbush? I'm the king of my hood. Now let's see how that look. Come on, my nigga, we on go, my nigga, for all of my doors in the pen. You said you was gang, but you never hang, and I guess it was a mess. The picture I paint is never gonna change, RPG, we gonna win. So the last edit also reminded me of montages like Letif, etc. that you see in YouTube. So really great montages, but but I will say though that the sound design was kind of missing in this video. Like there wasn't really a lot of sound to complement the edit. Once again, very cheap montage and for the price, very, very good. All right, so I think the Zero Review editors did a good job, honestly. It was an experiment to see what it would be like and I wasn't disappointed at all. They all had a bit different style, which I think was very cool. A lot of them has taken some inspiration from Letif videos, I can see. For my worth of montage though, I gotta go with KHXN. His montage only costs 10 euro and it's just on point as always. It really has that Letif montage quality in my opinion. I think everything's just on point. Anyways, thanks to all the editors. I'll leave them in the description for you guys to check out and I'll see you in the next one.